Hi, my name's Wes Corwin. I'm, uh, I'm, down, I'm down in this region somewhere. When Mikey and I thought of the idea for comedy cockfights, we knew there were going to be two kinds of battles we could set up. One of which would be between people that respected each other's crafts, but also enjoyed roast comedy, so they'd be able to rib each other, go a little harsher than typical, uh, while still maintaining a level of respect. I don't think that's what you're going to see right now. I, I'm not worried about shit. <laughs> this guy hasn't been on stage in I don't know how long. The last time he came on stage was in his work uniform as a bartender. I think I'm all set. Nah, I really do feel like his beef with me generally is him not making it. You know, I, I know personally people that have received calls from him on the suicide hotline. Uh, but it was baby Tylenol that you were taking, so. He was the first person I met in this scene. And uh, look, at, look where I'm at now. <laughs> He has two full pages about me, and I think it's just uh, shows the dedication to how much Phil think about a man in his off time. You know, my, my targets <clears throat> is jeans. First of all, I don't know how you fit balls in those jeans, but I don't think you're gonna bring them to the stage, man. I just hope before tomorrow night uh, he doesn't spread uh, peanut butter on the end of his pistol, uh, so he tastes at least two sweet things uh, for the relief of his life. Hello. You pretend like you're nice, but everybody knows that cigarette raspy voice of yours is just a front to get people to fuck you. That's all it is. Um, I want him to build the courage to finally just hang himself. I wasn't getting any laughs at first, and then I said your name. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. The whole room lost it because they know you're a joke. He <laughs> seems upset that he wasn't the one that got touched and, uh, you know, by a priest. Fuck Phil. <laughs> fuck you. If you had asked me a week ago, I would have said these two people were friends. You wear your fancy little shirts with like hip-hop legends faces on them and shit every now and then. You're gonna die just like them. Good night, Phil. Good night.